Kenya Power says it will restructure its debt to give it room to operate optimally. The utility firm, dogged by a string of declining profit, put up a brave face during its annual general meeting, assuring pensive shareholders that all was still well. Denis Sotieno reports. During Kenya Power's 98th annual general meeting, which was held virtually, Energy Principal Secretary Joseph Nyoroge announced the plan to support the parastato. If you look at um, uh, the debt portfolio of KPOs, and it's a mixture of on-land loans from the National Treasury, and those loans are concessionary, and also commercial loans, uh, quite a huge uh, figure of uh, the debt, and Together with the National Treasury, we are working on a debt restructuring, which should give a lot of relief to KPLC. In its financial year ended June 2019, net profits dropped more than 91% to hit 262 million shillings, from 3.27 billion shillings posted a year earlier. Despite raking in more than 130 billion shillings in revenues annually, the firm is staring at financial distress. The Auditor General stated the company was approaching insolvency as its short-term obligations surpassed short-term assets by a massive 71 billion shillings. The financial statements for the year ended that year, June 2019, received an unqualified opinion or what we call clean opinion. Njoroge, who sits on the board of the company, has however ruled out nationalization, saying the company remains on the path to recovery. There is a moratorium so that uh, the, the government has given a break to requiring reimbursement of what uh, the government pays on behalf of KPLC and Kenjin. Managing Director Bada Nguge addressing shareholders promised to turn the curve and once again put the profit light back on at the utility firm. We want to leverage on technology and introduce more innovative ways to deal with our business uh, going forward. And we also want to create operational autonomy, which have given the regional managers who, are, who take care of a number of counties, county business managers as well, run the business with autonomy. Denis Otieno, Citizen TV.